if we had a stage right now and we had Samini right here and we had Chatawali mm. and they played a song that you both knew how to sing, mm. would you sing along with him or you walk off the stage? I'll sing along with him. He came on my stage to surprise me during Samini Fest last year. And how did that feel for yeah. you? Yeah, it was a surprise and it was a good one yeah. because then um, he, try, he has tried to apologize to me on different platforms. Mm -hmm. You know, just trying to show to the fans that, all right, we were only joking, right. so you people don't take it too serious. Right. Coming onto my set yeah. without tweeting, without hyping, just showing up. Yeah. I think he came to try and make a mark, and the mark was made. Yeah. So Do you think that that. that that also bridged the gap in a way? Yeah, it, it helped the streets calm down, because right. it was an election year as right. well. It helped the streets calm down, because, mm -hmm. you know, we needed everybody to be focused, and then we all choose and change power or maintain power, whatever it is, right. in, peace. in peace. So we didn't need music rivalry. Yeah. At that time, what we needed was a unified music mu musical body mm -hmm. to calm down the city, yeah. and I think that move helped in making all of that happen. Right. If As anybody, that, if any other dancehall artists, because mm -hmm. we're speaking in terms of dancehall artists, mm -hmm. any other dancehall artists also came up later on and tried to start beef with you, <laughs> based on the experience you've had mm -hmm. with Chatawali, do you think that you would? No, I think I think, I think Bandana deserves my response okay. because he he knocked hard enough you know right, me right. and how i keep it constructive right i listened to him from 2006 to 2013 mm -hmm. before i did scatter bad mind right. one song right. to right. respond to i think a hundred beef songs to me right and that came and made the mark right i don't think anybody deserves my response if they bring beef i've not finished dealing with the aftermath of high grade family and shatter movement yeah, okay yeah all until right. that stadium concert and that world tour mm -hmm. happens mm -hmm. for us to prove to the world that all right high grade family shatter movement together stand for a unified movement rather than factions at war mm -hmm. until that happens mm -hmm. i think we still have our healthy rivalry which makes the streets interesting um so do you actually think that um you know this beefing thing should continue or should it be done in a healthy fashion or we should just uh, it, should, it, should, it, should, it should be done in a healthy fashion because if the world has allowed fighting mm -hmm. to be legal for us to have two people in a, in a ring to punch each other and then we have referees to show us the rule in which punch is a good punch and which punch is not <laughs> then i think musicians can also be uh guarded if they want to use lyrics and sharp mouth as their strength in making the crowd excited right so you choose your words right you make sure you you stay within you know because you can't do curse words if you want to win a freestyle battle no you can't insult so there's to things win. exactly so there's yeah. things that would eventually disqualify you and then you will find a well credible battle artist who doesn't just chat dirty vibes but yeah. he's gonna make it to the top anyway right